Okay, Assalamualaikum. Welcome back with Odi on Oddberry. So in this video, I'm going to share a few arguments regarding a video I uploaded before. Coincidentally, someone commented that because they kept waiting for the RTX 4060 but couldn't get it, they ended up buying the RTX 5060 and paired it with a 400 watt PSU. Coincidentally, this also serves as a testimonial given in the comments here, stating that he uses the RTX 5060 with this 400 watt PSU to run his system, paired with a Ryzen 5 4600U, like that. And coincidentally, there was also a rebuttal in the YouTube comments saying to immediately replace the PSU. A 400 watt PSU for an RTX 5060 will make your VGA die quickly. So there are two opinions like that, guys. If we calculate it mathematically, the Ryzen 5 4600U has a TDP of 65 watts at full load, but it can reach 80 to 90 watts. Meanwhile, the estimated TGP for the RTX 5060 is around 160 watts at full load. Plus with other components like RAM, SSD, and fans which we'll assume are default, that's roughly 60 watts. So the total power consumption of that system runs at about 310 watts. So if you have a quality 400 watt PSU, it's definitely still very safe to use. Then, if it's often used at full load continuously, even if it has an 80 plus certification, its lifespan can still be shorter and it can even make the system unstable. Based on experience, many people have encountered situations like this. But that's why a lot of people recommend that the PSU should be at least 500 watts. So it's not that 400 watts isn't enough, but having some extra reserve and for long term use, it will be safer. That's my opinion. 400 watts will work, but 500 watts is the safer choice.